minions today we are going to be hiding some cables we are starting from square one as if we just got this in the mail Ooh, oh uh, don't worry it's not spring loaded it's just assisted open all my police officer friends you're gonna confiscate this i know you are let's go ahead and hide some cables in the wall today shall we now i looked at a few different systems that would allow us to hide cables in the wall personally i like this guy because it comes with a free toy surprise i think something's lost in the translation because this is not a toy I'm trying to replicate cracker jacks i don't know but it's not a toy however it's quite nice we're going to be using this guy to punch our hole our little template so that then we can pop this inside the wall and then these little wings come out and grip the drywall uh, in the hole that we just drilled. How easy is that? Now, before we go to town with this thing, odds are you're probably something like me and you're probably installing some sort of bracket or you have one in place. Just be sure to put the TV mounting bracket on beforehand to ensure that, let's see, there's a stud there and there's a stud there. Obviously, we're gonna go in between the studs. <laughs> I'm gonna show you guys something really, really cool. Check it out. So we're gonna go right about there. But wait, oh, there it is. And look, I have a charging station here already. So we're gonna pop the cables through the other wall and this wall, and there will be no cables whatsoever in the other room. Everything is plugged in on this side. <laughs> if you want to save yourself some cleanup, go ahead and use the included box and kind of position it under like so, and it will catch a lot of the drywall powder that's gonna be coming down when you do your drilling. Here's a tip for all the boomers out there. Whoa, <laughs> that sounded bad. Before you actually install this in, consider putting the cables in. It's much easier to thread cables through, whether you're going straight through the wall like I am or straight down like most people are, but it's much easier to actually pre-thread the cables like so. Just be careful not to drop it completely into the wall. Then at that point, now we can easily thread this through here and pop it in. Much easier to thread instead of trying to smash it through this little rubber thing. Then you're gonna go ahead and slide this into the hole, peel back this rubber face to expose the Phillips head, and then we're going to hand turn this to lock in the little wing naughty bits. That's it. Is it not beautiful? Do you see any cables whatsoever dangling down? You don't, do you? That's because it's all hidden in there. So that's the installation, fairly cut and dry. I hope this saved you a few minutes from having to dissect the instructions in the tutorial. How Martha stewart -y. Martha Stewart does not like cables. And nor do I. Hey, five out of five stars. My name is Bo Shavisu. Catch you later.